two particles P and Q. I have only 5% of power left over. We may end up class abruptly. Let, let me finish off at least this problem. Morning, from, from morning, there is no power. No. Okay. Two particles P and Q are oscillating along the parallel, so both with their respective mean portion at x equals zero. Extreme portion that plus on both have same time period at equals zero particle P the P is at minus a by two. So the P I'll take it to be a and moving along negative x direction. It should be like this. What about Q? Q is at plus A by root 2. And moving along positive X direction. They are going to meet. So let, let's get these angles. Uh, they should be 45. They should be 30. Am I right, directly? What is actually going on? What actually happens, sir? Are they moving in circle? No, they're not moving in circle. They are, they are in fact like this. The common mean position. So the Uh, x equal to uh, p, p is at q. Okay, th this is a q. a by root 2 uh, and this is at a by 2. Try to see, see this one. So how the motion of this, this will, it will go like this. Yeah, just to, to make you think, I, I'm just bringing this. It can be, yeah. oh, let it be. And that color, let me choose for this. The P will take a path. So is there any possibility of meeting them? And there's a primary question is what we have to ask it. So this is A by two. This is at P equals zero. This at t equal to zero. It can it can happen, no? So it can. The, where do they can meet now? <coughs> Q. What happen will go like this, and 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 will be here. So the p will go here. So that they can meet here. So let let let's assume that let them meet somewhere here. This one. Okay, this at time t. <coughs> now, what shall we do here now? <coughs> They'll meet somewhere here. So, what is that green color? Green color one. I'll, I'll write it here. Somewhere at this particular point. Q will be moving and here P will be moving. So this angle will also be 45. So this angle is 30 degrees. So any, any equation can be write 45 plus 90 plus theta. I'll get into mathematics, 45 plus theta, 45. Is 
is equal to 60 90 minus theta 60 plus 90 minus theta by t so theta what i'm i'm getting 7.5 degrees then time taken 45 plus 90 plus t is equal to 2 pi by t convert everything in terms of radian then express in terms of t by 2 because pi has to be eliminated no Okay, the phasor diagram is in a, you'll be on safer side, either pendulums or the particles, two pendulums or two particles are there, no? So the, the phasor diagram is going to help you a lot. Uh, they are very popular, please do practice few uh, in material or anywhere, many places available. I'm not equating velocity here. These are not velocity, angular displacement. Angular displacement by time taken should be equal to angular displacement by time taken. Because the P and Q, its projection no, will be executing SHM. This is like uniform circular motion. Uh, it's not that something we should equate angular velocity. It's the wrong idea. It's a graphical method. How much of angular displacement the Q will have? 45 plus 90 plus theta by T much of angular displacement it will have 60 plus 90 minus theta. Don't say any velocity because the particles, if the air Q and P, if they move in circular path, their projections will execute FHM. Since these are uniform velocity, no? So I'll equate here because both are having same time period. Both are having same time period. Since they're having same time, they're not, if they're having different time period, you do write 2 pi by T1 for this 2 pi by T2, solve it. Okay, uh, these are things, so please do revise all, uh, especially the mains, you uh, you are going to get very good questions than advanced. You see, advanced, we can manage, but especially the mains, no, and the something related to phase or compound pendulum or simple pendulum, best questions are available. Check once the mains paper, you'll, you'll get an exact picture in SHM. They're more bothered about the kinematics of SHM, simple pendulum, compound pendulum. And dam dorsation, four dorsation work. What all we discussed, so many lengthy questions, no, they are out of syllabus for mains. As exam approaches, I'll, I'll be giving you instruction what, for a which chapter, what only you should prepare. We've done so many lengthy problems, no, you can avoid all that one. But these are very important for mains. Simple pendulum, compound pendulum, kinematics of SHM, some graph problems, then dam and four dorsation.